Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, Gale has oh, something to say to us. All right. Not even close. Okay, cool. I'll get to you, buddy. But uh, last time we started the siege on the Grove, and this time probably going to be completing it. So let's see what he has to say now. My condition is worsening again. I need to consume some powerful magic or it may become volatile. Okay, give me all, give me a magic item. Color spray I need. Those I need. Wait, why do I have those? Those should be equipped to... Those should be equipped to him. I don't know why it's saying they're equipped to me. Equipped by Shadowheart, equipped by Shadowheart. Okay, so... Guidance pendant. I do not want to give that away. Uh, actually, where the hell are? Hold on. Perhaps I'm not conveying the urgency of the situation. It's incredibly, world-shatteringly important you give me a suitable artifact, please. Uh. I said you don't quite appreciate the urgency of the matter. Dawdling may cost. Okay, but where the fuck are all our things? Yeah, these weren't showing up. We have a locket of dancing lights. Definitely gonna give that to him. Uh, this I'm keeping for someone who can use it, probably. I can probably give him those, and I can definitely give him those. So, the fact that these are in the pouch is fucking with it. So I'm going to be putting them outside the pouch. What's on your mind? Apart from finding that is most gratifying to hear. Uh, give the magical artifact, dancing lights, right? Yes. Thank you. It is a strange experience. Each time anew, I kind of lost soul is spelunking through the darkness that is me, only to be sacrificed on the dread altar of the heart. But this doesn't feel quite right. I mean, it never feels right, but it relieves. This doesn't relieve. Oh. Mm. What's happening? The magic isn't having the effect it should have. It's not like the last time. Like a rain a fucking that quells the forest fire. It merely drizzles. The embers still sizzle. The fire remains undefeated. I'm not certain what's going on, but nothing good. Please, I need to think. I need to retrace my steps to a glade of calm and think. Thank you for the artifact. A great deal of trouble it was, too. A great deal of trouble, indeed. Okay. So now that that's settled, forward. let's go back to the grove and start kicking some ass. I did get my armor back, by the way. Uh, why didn't everybody come? Where the hell is Gale and... Faith will guide me. Oh, they're over there. You're telling me they can't jump back? You're kidding. Okay, here's what we're doing, everyone. We're gonna fast travel here, and we're all gonna walk over there together. Okay? So that's progress. Jesus. Oops. Put them on top, please. Thank you. This should be just open forever now. Good thing I took out those, uh, things. I was surprised that they didn't immediately trigger combat as soon as that happened. That was a little, little weird, but... Time to head down this way. 
Because I'm sure the elevator's not on. <laughs> but either way, I'd want to... Go that way. Oh, wow. Oh, here's all the practice stuff. Backpack full of nothing. Storage chest full of nothing. Yeah, this is going to be good if I ever need to get some gold and just sell shit. Definitely need to do that. Kids packed off and lift home, went home. Cool. Get out of here while you kid. This should be... Ah! And they're defending over there. Okay, I thought these guys were fighting us. I was like, what the fuck, dude? I thought we were cool. Can't have disadvantage. Can't have disadvantage. Why am I disadvantaged? Outside normal range. So I can run. And I do have advantage. Uh, straight up just merc the dog. Which I think I will do. Never mind. I'm gonna dash around. Build up those fucking charges. Good shit. Okay, rip. Oh, this is straight up Koga. Or Paga. Okay. You, my good sir. Hmm. Interesting dilemma here. Ice knife, pretty good. If they were more grouped up. Maybe I can do that to them. This ice knife does the explodes to anyone nearby. Saved. That fucking bitch. Shadowheart, get in there. Have to keep going. For now, you're just gonna use a cantrip. Try to kill this dog before you get to turn. Motherfucker, dude. Dude, he's so low health. What the hell? I'll put that over there. <laughs> oh, she's... Couldn't tell if she was hiding or running away. What is that? Flaming sphere? Uh, within five feet. Oh, wow. Cool. Okay, we are slightly getting outnumbered here. Oh, what a shot. Good shit. Gonna lacerate this guy. Critical hit. But he's saved. Okay. Where is Koga? She is my main target here. Um, uh, so my attack does five to ten, just one to ten. Uh, I should have hexed him. Damn it. Uh, she's very wisdom. Oh my God. She's so good. She's so good. Across the board. I'm just going to go in there and hit her. And then, who has the lowest armor class? Gale? Well, I'm gonna be hit, getting hit way more than Gale. So I should put it on myself. That puts my AC up to like 21, 22? 22. That will be very hard to hit. He's running in. Cool. Shapeshifted. Blinded him. Damn. Okay. 
Ball can move. Ball can move. Uh, should we get rid of it? I guess. Fuck. Good enough. Dashing those charges up. And I got five now. Maintain concentration, but now I gotta pick my fucking sword up again. Okay, Gale's gonna get in there. I'm gonna do the... Should I do level two? I'm gonna spend a level two on her. Fuck you, goddammit. Um... Plan is you should probably heal. Take you. Okay, that works. Healing word. On you. He got blade ward. I don't know why he got blade ward. Oh, it cat. Oh, those gauntlets. Okay, cool, 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 cool. It just casts Blade Ward on him, it doesn't. So it wouldn't stack with Blade Ward. So do I get Blade Ward too? Oh, goddamn. Yeah, we're struggling just a bit. Everybody gets Featherfall. I don't know why he would do that. Ah, damn. Does Featherfall do something I'm not aware of? Okay. Yeah, it's just falling damage. Fuck it. Kill the dog. I need to pick up my weapon. And I need to equip my weapon again. That takes an action. Unfortunately, a bonus action, I will hex her... Strength? Charisma? Wisdom? I'll, I'll do wisdom. No, because that's we don't have anything that targets wisdom, huh? Disadvantage on intelligence check. I guess we'll do strength. No, we'll do dex. Okay, he's doing good over there. Okay, let's see. So he can definitely kill this bird, which will turn him back into a... druid. And then I can go up and bite him. What does Bloodless do? Feel a bit woozy, minus one to attack rolls, saving throws, and most ability checks. Okay, cool. So I like that he's running away and taking those two with him. Because that takes the pressure off us. I am so fucking sick of you. Okay. Actually, this is a problem. Running hands. So Shadow Hearts kind of in the way. She took off her hex too somehow. Um shocking grasp. Oh, this is a deck save. I should have hexed her dex. Just him. It fucked. And you're doing good on health. You, good madam, are not. 
Which one does more? This one. Okay. And I don't have a bonus action to do. Damn. Damn, blind and he still fucking got him. Or was it? He took off blind. Ayo. Good shit. Oh no, he's coming this way. God fucking damn it, dude. This is a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. No choice but to keep going. Okay. So if I cast healing word on myself. My AC is still very high, right? It's still at 20. Yeah. So I can do... This on her. Oh, it's an action. Yeah, no, I can do this on her. Shit, she saved. It's charisma save. Okay. And then I'm going to drink that. Okay, this is dangerous for sure. Good shit. Concentration broken. I will then attack you. Concentration broken. Jesus Christ. I will do that. Fucking bitch. Uh, unfortunately for you, plant growth. So what does plant growth do? Movement speed is quartered. Okay. But will that save her? So it will hit her there. And it cleared that. Perfect. Okay. She's off balance. Unfortunately. She also doesn't have an action for some... Oh, she does have an action. So what if I rush her? Critical hit. Hell yeah. She's got 14 HP left. Good shit, dude. Wish I'm riding the fire. Yeah, I need to start heading this way. Sometimes the only way out is through. You. Bonus action shove. Witch bolt. Well. It's one to ten. It's five to ten. Poke your sword in good hands. Yeah. That probably was the better choice. And then you. I'm too close to you. Target too close, threatened. Fight bonus action, disengage. And run off this way. I can sneak attack you and get you the fuck out of here. Good shit. So all that's left is this boar. The flaming rock died because the caster died. And then this guy over here. So let's kill this boar. Ah, uh, that's why. Okay. I can still cast those, it's just I'd have to cast them at second level. Just fine. I'll put two on him. Two on him. 
Okay. Didn't break him, though, unfortunately. That... God damn it, Shadowheart. Nice. Okay, dead. <laughs> Fucking bitch. I'm getting in there. Behold the dance of death. Okay. I fuck this man. What do I have to lose? And I smite him. That's exactly what I fucking wanted. Okay. Holy hell. Okay, so, first thing I want to do... What's next, I wonder? So she's got no spell slots, so we're gonna have to take a short rest. Or a long rest, I mean. Might as well heal her up. Well, I mean, if we're all taking a long rest, it doesn't matter. If we're taking a long rest, it doesn't matter. So... Uh, let's do that before we loot. We'll do that before we loot. Because, uh, that way if we're looting and anything happens, I won't- oh shit, no. I want to no talk way. to Gale now, apparently. Something's on my mind. Hell of a fight, hey, champ. <laughs> Your spell is attracting mosquitoes. Oh. My. You startled me. I, uh... It's miles away. You're praying to your goddess? If so, I'd like to join in your vigil. So I was. Praying she'd aid me. Mistra. For indeed it was her image I conjured. Commands all magic. Salvation, if such a thing exists, is hers to bestow or withhold. And yet even now, more than I fear losing my own self and soul, I fear losing my command of her art. Magic is... my life. I've been in touch with the Weave for as long as I can remember. There's nothing like it. It's like music, poetry, physical beauty, all rolled into one and given expression through the senses. Would you like to experience this? Uh, sure. Then follow my lead. Oh, we're going somewhere? Oh, I do. It, there is a difference in my eye. There's like a gold bit. Sleight of hand, arcane performance. Sleight of hand. We got it. Oh, I'm doing magic. You feel something strange. Like a kind word and a kind touch at the same time. It's warm and comfortable. Excellent. It's not cold now, and bloody. Oh, I like it. Me. Oof. Oof. Hey. Suddenly, the scent of rose water and a sense of well-being. A sliver of weave that tastes sweet on the tongue. Very good. This is getting now, a little too close. I want you to picture it. in your mind the concept <laughs> of harmony. As true as you can. Concept of harmony. Ooh. Hold on now. 
history, nature, and sight performance. Try to hum a familiar tune. Oh, barely. You see, or is it sense, the presence of a woman? The woman who hovered over Gale's palm. There's something like the anticipation of a kiss. Then the pleasure of being cloaked in peace. <laughs> you are safe. You are nestled in the cup of Mistra's hand. Oh, they're so close. <laughs> you did it. You're channeling the weave. How does it feel? Feels like bros being dudes. <laughs> uh... Magical. does. The weave connects you. The moment feels intimate. <laughs> Just dudes being bros, man. Uh, you're not in. You're in no mood to be close to Gale. Release your grasp on the weave. The weave evaporates. Oh. And as it does so, you realize the night feels suddenly cold and lonesome. Oh. There it goes. How easily things slip away from us. No matter how hard they were in the obtaining. Good night. I enjoyed sharing a moment of magic with you. Bro? <laughs> <laughs> Just guys being dudes? Uh, was that it? Shadowheart didn't need to speak to me, no? Okay. The hell was I doing? Sleeping. That's all right. <laughs> Took me on a magical journey. Okay. Back to the grove. We're going to do some looting. Oh, yeah, this is going to be a lot. She is. What's in here? Silver or doggy. Oh, I will take the mugwort. Not the sickle. Damn it! How can I help? I shut the fuck up. I go talk to the goblin. I'm over encumbered now. And now we take the time to sort through all this shit. Let's just see if there's any goodies. Got some good armor, good armor, necklace, nature plus one, just straight up. Elixir of Sylvanus. Neutralizes the effects of all poisons. Interesting. Rune of the Wolf. Okay. It'll probably be used later. Rude Mother's Revenge. Whenever the wearer is healed, their weapon becomes coated in magic and deals an additional 1d6 poison damage. Who? So Gale. Ah, oh, but he doesn't do fucking melee. I have to speak with the dead. His guidance. She has that. Um, I want to give this to anyone. I will keep it for myself. Because I do get healed a lot. But I will keep this to have it on ready, basically. Uh, the plus one nature, I guess I'll give to her since she doesn't have a helmet at the moment. And then, yeah, I will sort through the rest of the shit. Give me one second. Okay, everything's sorted. Good to go. Let us go inside here to see what happens next. 
Hello, everyone. I'll be yoinking that. Ah. Huh. Okay. Detailed report. Grimy report. Warning. Chest. Grove animals. Sturdy swords. All spring backpack. Spoon. Uh, wicker chest we can check. Maybe we already did. Knife. Um, anything else? Doesn't look like it. So let's head in here. Now we can finally have, you know, all the rights to the place. Take that. Wooden chest. Ooh. Evil eye. What is that? How do I get there? Is that just around? Okay. Should have her key for that. Yep. Use her key. Get out of my way. I used her key. Very cool. Cool. Some books. Read them. Okay. About our letter. Swamp docks, tree, meat alone. Okay. Huh. So. I go to my journal. As was defeated before you get to where maybe his research can be his use. Okay. Gotta do that. Uh. Yo, cargo complete. Defeat the goblins. Complete. Raid. I like her dead. Grove belongs to the absolute. Mother of... Okay. Need to talk to her. Uh, daughter of darkness? No. Huh. I guess that didn't really... Did that complete some stuff? Huh. Looks like it. Doesn't really look like there's anything left. Now all we gotta do is... Oh, here we go. Okay. That's all it was updating. Okay, so we still gotta look for his... Uh, his research. I'm trying to think of words and it's hard and it hurts my brain. <laughs> There's another pouch here. Nothing in it. Grove artifacts. Okay, it's just a tablet. Stone tablets. Not really anything more of interest here. So let's head into the other room. Oops, there's mud. Okay, here we go. On antidotes. Huh. I guess that might have started a quest or something. Oh. I guess there's something I can make. Combined items. Weird. I wonder what that would be. Anyway. Wooden chest. Did I check this already? Nope. Potions. And then there's a ton of... More alchemy shit. Carrot. Um, wicker chest, just a book, wicker chest, just a book, book, or gloves, are those important? Do those do anything? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Okay, we got a chest right here, some apples, we got a chest right here, some potions. 
Got a chest right here. Good shit. Wicker chest. Pear and apple. Backpack. Nothing. Okay. And then we need to go back here in order to get... Oh, did I already sell his notes? Oopsie doopsie. I might have done a fucky wucky. And that guy's long dead, so... Oh well. Personal account? No. Starting to think I, uh... Curious. What's curious? I missed it. <laughs> Just the... The rune? I'll put the rune in there now. Empty slot. And then we need the wolf rune. Did that do anything? Ah. Ah, I need to press them all. Here goes nothing. Well, what cool entrance. It's gonna be another long one. Jesus. Was there anything I missed over here? No. Down we go. Holy shit, just immediately took me. Hidden vault. Sorrow. Druid note. What did the druid note say? Okay. Secrets. Oh. Shadow druids. Okay, just dark just the cars. Uh, let's see if these boxes in here. Oh, these boxes do have shit in them. Excellent. How about this one. Robes of summoner. Grants resistance to cold. That's not very summoner-like. Okay, I guess sorrow was the big thing. What is this? It's a glaive. It's a two-handed glaive. Sorrow's lash. What does that do? Is that a, a whip? Pulls them ten feet closer. Race for melee, lacerate, rush attack. That's pretty fucking good. If I didn't like my AC so goddamn high. Maybe I put that on... Maybe I respect Gale into being a warlock. Because they can... They can use the packed weapon to... Give them proficiency with whatever weapon they're holding. As long as they cast it. That'd be really cool! <laughs> and Warlocks are just so good. But I think that's it for now. I think I'm gonna head back to... What's-her-face? Okay, I'm back, everybody. Where is... There she is. Praise the Absolute. She will reward us well. For this exquisite carnage. Hell yeah. All right. What a lovely afternoon. A real pleasure. The true honor is to serve the absolute. She loves you fiercely. I see that. In the strength she has given you. And she has so much more to give. There is a bond between us, true soul. I can see what you are, what you want, blood, and you can see what I want. Through her eyes, you see yourself, skin glistening with sweat, hands bound, ecstasy uh... or terror, maybe both. Is she coming on to me? Uh, you feel yeah. Her breath on your her fingers running down your spine. Okay. <laughs> it is over. I will come to your camp tonight. We will celebrate this victory. Together. Okay, leave. <laughs> <laughs> 
As you oh, it just goes camp, right into it, the huh? The raucous celebrations have already begun. The goblins praise the absolute, but their celebrations also honor their leaders, Minthara, and you. You fought well, and so did these creatures. Did she gonna take a bath age. first? God damn. When you tire of their company, come to me. Tonight, you are mine. Jesus! Oh my god, okay, what is this? Gift from the absolute? It's just, uh, okay. This one is a true soul parasite. It can enhance you. You can absorb its potential. Open your mind to it. You already know how. Um, I think I've been pretty clear on I don't want to be using don't the worry. tadpoles. You won't come to harm. I'll protect you. Yeah, no, not happening. Sorry. You are not ready. That's all right. But try to overcome this resistance sooner rather than later. It will make things much easier for you. Nah, fam. Wow, they really have been uh, fucking on my camp, huh? Nice. Oh, a Starian has something to say. What's up, bro? Well, hello. Welcome to my humble party. What's your poison? Red? White? <laughs> Just water. <laughs> your funeral. So, what are we drinking to? Other than a pile of corpses. Um, <laughs> to victory, of course. To victory. Mmm. Delicious. <laughs> Delicious water. <laughs> so, what happens next? Uh... Between us? Uh, nothing. Dude, bro? Broski? Bro Chacho? Nothing? <laughs> How can you be so cruel? Bro, I don't Come know if on. you heard, but this lady kind of just here. called dibs before you, I bro. Know you felt it too, <laughs> darling. Uh, there isn't. I haven't. <laughs> so uh, they're always do it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mistook you for someone with taste. But have it your way. I'm happy to entertain myself. Okay, dude. Cool. Oh, damn. They really fuck shit up over here, huh? I wonder if they have any loot on them. A sword. Uh, just like their weapons, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Bunch of junk. Oh, they stopped looting. <laughs> Look what oh. I found. Is that a golden tooth? Huh? Think it's just oh, yellow. Oh, he's chasing the dog. I swear to God, if if you kill that dog, don't you dare put your fucking any hands on him. I will kill everyone in this camp and then myself. Okay, let's talk to her. She looks you up and down. Her mind touches yours. You feel her hand at your neck, her lips closing around yours. Are you ready to give yourself to me? Uh, where's my <laughs> yes, mommy answer? <laughs> Good. Uh, yeah. I will join you when you go to your bed. You are mine. Okay, calm down. Yikes. <laughs> hey, Oathbreaker Knight, you, uh, you want to get on this? No? Just me? Okay. I'm a little scared, not gonna lie. <laughs> you are here. Good. Come with me. Oh, damn. Oh, are we in the church? Is my little butler guy gonna come up and just going like, Yes, pound her, master, pound her! No. Lie down. Uh, 
Is this a seduction or a sacrifice? Neither. It is an instruction. Now, silence. Lie down. Ah, fuck it. Yep. Oh. Might have to cut this for YouTube. I don't know. I have nudity turned off, so. You learn fast. I literally just sat down. Your obedience will make this more enjoyable for both of us. Tell me what you want. Uh. You, baby. Okay. Uh, I, I have nudity turned off. I don't know how this is gonna go. Uh, I don't know how much of this I'm gonna have to cut for YouTube. But oh, she's got a little pasties on. Okay. Good stuff. <laughs> oh my God! She's sucking my leaf. <laughs> she, bitch is sucking. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> Oh jeez Oh my god they're really getting into it huh Is that it? No? Going all night? Okay. We're having fun. It's fade to black. Just fade to black. Thank you. Fade to black. Thank you. As your bodies lock together, so do your minds. Her whole being is laid bare before you. And half hidden at the center of her desire, you discover something unexpected. Fear. Oh. Uh, imagine snapping her neck. No. Uh, pry deeper into her heart for her fears. Maybe we should. We could like make her afraid, and then we'll gain her trust like that to screw over the absolute. You know. That's my plan anyway. I want to be on top. Of a life spent anticipating a night Even though I was just back. on bottom. Ooh. The memories of countless dead slain too soon. Not just enemies, but family, friends, lovers. Speak to me. Tell me what is in your heart. Uh, curiosity. There's more to you than I thought. I could say the same of you. There is something about you that disturbs me. The moment we were alone together, something changed. I felt it, and you must have felt it too. The Absolute fell silent. How is that possible? The artifact pulses softly, sending out a warning. It is a friend. Uh, the Absolute... Uh, question your heresy. <laughs> Maybe she's abandoned you. The weapon you saw it. I have it. Okay, well these are all pretty... The Absolute can't reach you while you're with me that's probably the best answer because all these other ones are you know like questioning her loyalty and all this shit whereas this one really really is vague enough this is blasphemy but so much that has happened since i left the underdark is like a dream of 
somebody else's life. I do not know myself anymore, except tonight. Tonight, I wanted this for myself. I must pray, and you must rest. Tomorrow, we will have fresh orders. Okay. In your dream, you stand over yourself as you sleep. A knife in your hand. Murder in your heart. <gasps> this bitch! You are ready to strike, to end your own life. But then a shock runs through your mind. This is no dream. Was it not good enough for you? <laughs> you don't like the taste of lettuce? <laughs> Wake up, Truso. We must talk. I watched over you as you slept. Peaceful and silent. And I spoke to our god. I asked her why she had chosen you. Made you one of her faithful. When you are so clearly broken. Beautiful. But broken. There is something missing in you. And I do not understand it. When the Absolute failed to answer me. I feared that you had somehow infected me with that same absence. And so I decided that you must die. But then a Rude. miracle happened. As I took out my blade, her voice returned to me. And she told me what I must do to purge myself of doubt. She told me to decide your fate. To determine if you are worthy. If you are, I am to send you into her embrace. At the seat of her power. Does that mean killing me or are we actually going somewhere? Uh, we're both worthy. Let's go to the absolute together. Uh, can somebody wake me up and give me guidance, please? Oh my god, that worked. Oh, difficulty class two. Never mind. Fuck. In time. I'd I say she's easy, but that's established. <laughs> Travel to Moonrise. We will meet again there, at the heart of the Absolute's power. You said the Absolute demanded my death. Why? I do not know. But I do know that she allowed me to spare you. When you meet her at Moonrise, she will show you her design and your part in it. She will test you. If you fail, you will break. If your faith is strong, you will become something even more beautiful. I'm ready. How do we get there? How do I get there? With difficulty. But I can help. The land around Moonrise is cursed. Traveling there will sap your strength and your sanity. But I can protect you. A wretched creature in my service can guide you through the curse. This harp will summon him. Play it when you are in the shadows and he will come to you and know that you are a friend. What is the creature? He was a drow once. Now he is an abomination. A victim of Lolth's cruelty. His minions will wait for you at the mountain pass on the threshold of the shadow curse. I warn you. He is quite mad, but he knows the path to Moonrise better than anyone. Go to him when you are ready. I will lead what remains of my forces to Moonrise ahead of you. <sighs> when we next meet, we will be together in the Absolute's presence, and she will make us her champions. Cool. Oh, and I still get this thing. Because I didn't use it. Cool. Well, geez, that was quite the episode. Uh, I'm going to have to call it there. This was a long one. And uh, a lot of me not talking. So, Jesus, I'll see you in the next one.